Yo me lo como. En cuanto se den cuenta de que hay un puma justo detrás, vamos a flipar. Qué sensación más rara me acaba de dar. What's the problem? My goddamn horse got spooked and run off. Are you hurt? Not too bad, at least. But he took my damn leg. Sorry. He went that way, I think. His name's Buell. Buell? Second time a prick named Buell cost me a leg. Huh? Buell was my general when I lost it. Oh, uh, okay. Anyway, if you see an angry bastard of a horse with my wooden leg, I'd be real grateful. I'll bear that in mind. Come on, pal. Cálmate. Right. 
This way. Come on. Now come on, Dan. Let's get you back. Lo bonito que es. Oh. Just where you left it. Can't go far with that leg in your stirrup. Can't go bucking him like that. You better be good, you hear? I get the notion he's not a man you want to cross. No matter how big and strong you are. Vamos a devolverle. Sinclair. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. Hey, you want to hand me that leg there, please? And while you're at it, give old Buell a kick for me, would you? No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> Warren, but a snake that spooked him. <clears throat> you're a real gentleman, you know? Sometimes, maybe. Yeah, how'd you lose a leg? Oh, in the war. Cannonball. Pretty clean, though. I don't have much pain, and I didn't get any gangrene. A young boy went into battle with me, got cut in half, so all things considered, I'm doing pretty well, I guess. Yeah, I guess. So, uh, how is the false one? It's okay. I can still hunt, fish, enjoy the outside. I weren't sent too crazy by it. Anyway, I ain't got much to pay you with. You know, that's okay. You like fishing? You can come with me someday. I know some pretty good spots. Uh, I'm a pretty poor fisherman. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm great. So between the two of us, we do okay. My cabin is right over on the other side of O'Cray's Run there. Thanks again. Hey, you throw me again, you old dumb bastard. I'm gonna put a bullet in you. I'll see you again. Pobre caballo lleno de heridas, tío.
que haya estado antes. Arthur, how you doing? Nervous, but I've been nervous for a while. I had a lot of time to think in that jail, and I feel like I just don't know Dutch no more. You ain't the only one. And this plan to get us out, it just feels... I don't know. Like he's stringing us along, I know. <clears throat> Killing in cold blood, revenge. We all do bad things, but he seems to enjoy it now. It's like he just wants to create more enemies. More chaos. Yeah, I know. I mean, I love Dutch. He saved me a long time ago. I feel like in Saint Denis, when I got arrested, maybe he could have done something. I feel like you should take your woman and child and get lost. Do you? You can, you could give something to Jack. Hey, Strider. Well, I don't see no way out of this. Well, what about loyalty? Be loyal to what matters. What are you gonna do? I'll be okay, but do it for me. It would make me feel good, if that makes any sense. A little, but... Listen to me. When the time comes, you gotta run and don't look back. This is over. And now? Now we gotta help Dutch give the army one final tweak on its nose. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Help me with the rest of this. Well, it looks like we finally found our calling in life. We tried this thing out onto the bridge. There's a spot about a third of the way across where we can get down underneath to plant the charges. I've already set up the detonator. Sure, let's get this over with. You hear about Dutch and Cornwall? Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. More enemies, more chaos. I mean, all right, stop. Here's good. <sighs> we sure got a lot of this stuff. We'll need it. I'll climb down there, you lower the crates. All right, let me know when you're ready. Vale. Ready when you are. I'm at the bottom of the ladder here to your left. That's the spot. Lower it from there. Okay, start lowering it down. All right, take it slow. That's not something we want to drop. That's it. Okay, good. Grab the other one. Que sí, que voy. Just like last time, come on, nice and easy. Got it. All right, come down here and help me plant this stuff. Grab yourself a bundle from the box. The bridge is wired to the detonator. We need to attach each of those bundles to the fuses. There's one on each of the main support beams. Okay. a colocar la más lejana
Corre. Well, I guess old Dutch got all the smoke he wants. Well, let's hope so. <laughs> you really think that that'll draw attention away from us? I guess we'll see. Voy a ir un momento al baño. En cuanto pueda. I fully understand Dutch's plan with all this. Like I said, John, when the time comes, you go. What about loyalty to to everything? You've been loyal. I've been loyal. Look what that cost. You know, all that ever mattered to me was loyalty. It was all I knew. It's all I ever believed in. Well, not anymore, John. Soon, you gotta go. Go. But don't look back. I'll think about it. I've done a lot of thinking. Look at us. Out here risking our necks and for what exactly? For an idea that don't work no more. How you mean? You know just what I mean. You got a family. You need cash. You need to start building a life for yourself. Me? I need a vacation. And Dutch has all the money. For safekeeping. You know something? Abigail, I think she might know where some of that money is. Well, you tell her she better make sure. And then come talk to me. And we'll find out just who and what we should be loyal to. I, I don't know. Arthur. Nor do I. But I'm seeing things a lot more clearly now. I wish things were different. But it weren't us who changed. Yeah! <coughs> 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 